What's good, YouTube? Back with another video. We finna, uh, we finna watch, um, these stupid uh, police officers and they actions and what they do. Shit like that. Before we get into this video, man, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Drop a like on this video and on my other ones. You feel me? And, uh, reaction channel merch if you want some. Uh, QR code right here and the link will be in the description. So make sure you follow me on all my socials. Post on the daily. You feel me? Without further ado, let's get into this video. The 23rd, 2021. Officer Matthew Knutson conducted a traffic stop on a vehicle after it failed to give way to another motorist in Green Bay, Wisconsin. The driver, later identified as 47-year-old Robert Sanchez, allegedly pulled out into an intersection and nearly caused an accident. As Robert observed Officer Knutson turn around, he quickly pulled into a driveway and fled on foot. Boys, get back up on their feet. Boy, better stop. Everyone. Hey, Dr. Richmond and Bader. It's a truck. Bravo Charles, 1193. Get back in the car! Oh yeah, hold me down. Another officer nearby ordered him to stop, but he was non-compliant and continued fleeing. Get on the ground! It's a get female, that's why. Well. I'm not finna listen to no female talking about get on the ground. That wasn't my command, she's on Manitowoc, firehouse. Sir, get on the ground! Get on the ground! Oh, so females can't hey, get on the ground, you think you're on the ground? But no. Cause I would. Get your hands out of your pockets. Where's my next unit? I need one here in Manitowoc and Bader. She's scared, but. Sir, get your. Run your cell phone, Bader again. Get on the ground. I give her a prop for running up to the group. That's a female on him. That she won't. She love that job. Get on the ground. Get on the ground, sir. Bitch, she all out of breath, bitch. She might as well just give up. Right, Imperial. Despite being commanded to show she his hand several times, he refused, and the officer deployed her taser. However, it had no effect. Man, As Robert kept running, Officer Knutson drove his squad car over the curb and hit Robert with it, forcing him to the ground. Lord, that's what cops doing, bitch. <laughs> Get this nigga hit this nigga. They hit all this man ass out, bro. Hey, is that? Hey, Why'd you run? I'm scared. I'm scared. You're scared of what? <sighs> they hit all the wind. They hit all the wind out, my nigga. Okay. Push you to the ground. You're not injured. Catch your breath. He pushed them to the ground, but he's not. In So police got the right to hit niggas with cars now. It's easy. So niggas got the right to hit us with cars, police cars. It wasn't you don't tell us what they hold. Nigga, you hit him with the car. And now my nigga acting like he died more. My nigga probably did die. He can't even breathe. Like Robert Sanchez. Almost 11 months later, the Brown County District Attorney's Office contacted the Green Bay Police Department regarding Officer Knutson's actions that night. The body cam and squad car video of the incident were immediately reviewed alongside Officer Knutson's police report. While examining not even running that fast, like, inconsistencies in his explanation, I hopped out and ran, but I don't know, you hit this man. Contact with Robert during the pursuit. 
Following the assessment of the footage, Officer Knutson was placed on paid administrative leave, and the Green Bay Police Chief requested an investigation to be conducted by the Sheriff's Office. Approximately six months passed, and the DA's office officially filed a criminal complaint against Officer Knutson. The police Mom, chief made a public statement saying, We take all allegations of misconduct by Green Bay police officers seriously. I will not tolerate excessive force, ethical violations, or criminal yeah, damn, activity bro. He was, by GBPD members. Yeah, damn. He was running slow. You could have hopped out there be like, any other police doing it. You go catch my... You hit my... Door. I don't care if that bitch was hard. I don't care if that bitch was a tap. You just hit him. He stated, I started to pull my vehicle up on the western side of the driveway. In order to get my vehicle out of the roadway due to the other vehicles already on the road, the criminal complaint emphasized that statement, saying, You will find in his report that he describes him hitting Robert with his squad car at the last second and other vehicles being in the road. The squad camera tells a different story. There is no other I'm vehicle in the roadway in front of officers. He just, he just right to intentionally to drove by my and hit him. The district attorney further explained, there was no need for Officer Knutson to drive on the grass as there was no other vehicle in the driveway at that time. Additionally, he mentioned the officers Dang. on scene seemed to be amused by Robert's situation. He mentioned the timestamp of the occurrence, saying, After placing Robert in the rear of the squad car, Knutson can be seen mimicking Robert hobbling after being struck to the laughter of the other officers on scene. It was also discovered that the use of force sheets Great, he believe it, told it. did not mention him striking Robert with his squad car. The district attorney said Knutson gave a further indication that he meant to imply he had struck Robert accidentally. Without the use of force sheets and some of the video accident, recordings though. being disclosed, it is hard to determine how reliable these statements are. However, this wasn't the first time Officer Knutson was investigated for his conduct. In 2018, that nigga been doing that. one of nine other officers that were suspended because of a harassment investigation. A report of the internal investigation oh, stated there was a pattern of harassment by a small group of night shift officers. Some officers who were interviewed during the investigation hey, them described the night shift atmosphere like a frat house. The report further showed a female officer was the victim of hazing and harassment. She reportedly was so stressed out that she had to take off work to avoid harassment. Crazy. Officer Matthew Knutson, the 13-year veteran of the Green Bay Police Department, was charged with felony misconduct in public office and misdemeanor negligent operation of a vehicle. Robert was charged with misdemeanor counts of resisting, obstructing an officer, and operating while revoked. On the prosecutor's motion, both charges were dismissed shortly before the DA's office informed the police department of Officer Knutson's conduct. At this time, Knutson's investigation is still underway. Head over to CodeBlueCan.com. Oh. We're not going to forget the fact that it didn't get ran over to hit him with the cup. I don't know, but police weird. I don't like them. No way. And then he did. He did. Uh, that's for it. Man, that was the end of his reaction. Catch y'all in the next one.